Good evening, and thank you all for coming. When Joe asked, told me he was going to ask Nikki to marry him, I told him how happy I was and that Joanne and I were hoping that would happen. And then I gave him one other little tidbit. I said, Joe, she's still my little girl. And he said, oh, I know. <laughs> I know he'll take care of her and she'll take care of him. So I'm gonna propose the first toast for all these crazy times. For all of us, better times are coming. And for Joe and Nikki, the best of times are coming. All right, so first of all, um, thank you all for being here. Joe, thank you very much for honoring me with the uh, bestowment of best man. It's, it's a true privilege to be up here giving the speech. And I think it's best to start with the lady of, hour, the, lady of the hour, Mrs. Nicole. Uh, we first met in Joe and I's Royal Oak apartment and I was struck by your self-confidence by your well by how well behaved Joe was around you. <laughs> Trust me, you know, and by how caring you are towards all of us. When I learned that you were a teacher, a mentor, an athlete, and an Italian from the East Side, I was like, she's gonna be around for a while. I said, she's gonna be here for a bit. I'm incredib incredibly grateful that my best, friend's best friend found such a gifted partner with a beautiful maternal spirit and a zest for life. You tamed the stallion down a bit, and uh, you both grew a beautiful connection that we are all incredibly excited about. We all love you very much, and I wanted to formally hand over my roommate rights that I've earned over the years. Enjoy the crumbs all over the kitchen. Enjoy the greasy black hair in the shower and the loads of crumpled up laundry. You, you can have it all. We, lo we love you dearly, Nikki. Love you dearly. Now on to Joey Ballgame. Joey Ballgame, also known as Dolores. Uh, many other things. <laughs> um, you know, Nikki wasn't as lucky as I was. She didn't meet Joe as a flourishing, manly, long-haired, peach fuzzed, 150 pound Juco baseball athlete like I did. Uh, if you would have seen us at 18 years old, both completely undateable. It was, it was a true privilege to be with you during those times. Now, nevertheless, uh, back in fall of 2012, uh, we started our friendship together as roommates um, and as teammates at Grand Rapids CC playing baseball. Um, Joe's wit, his irreverence for authority, which I share to the heart of me, and his undying loyalty as a friend truly, you know, won me over quickly, as well as him being a clutch hitter. The dude just, he steps up and he just, he just delivers. Good evening, everyone. Now I have to follow that, so. Um, <laughs> I just want to start by thanking my, my in-laws for this beautiful wedding and Joe's parents. 
Um, for those of you who don't know me, I'm Rachel. I'm Nikki's sister-in-law, dance and travel partner, and theater date when my husband can't or doesn't want to have fun. <laughs> Throughout my years in the Paglia family, mine and Nikki's bond has grown from teasing her brother to working together briefly, and now to being each other's go-to for advice, a listening ear, or a shoulder to cry on. Nikki is the very definition of fun, energetic, patient, and supportive. All of the qualities you could ever want in a friend, teammate, teacher, sister, and most importantly, a life partner. So when I heard that she met Joe on her birthday, after running the Detroit Half Marathon at a Lions tailgate, before a family dinner, I'm exhausted just explaining how they met, I knew that she liked him enough to pencil him into her busy schedule, which obviously made us all curious about him. At the first family gathering of ours that he came to, Joe handled the cross-examination from Nikki's cousins well, such as, where did you go to school? Where do you work? And most importantly, do you like dogs? He does, by the way, they have two now. I personally knew that the answer to that question was going to be the beginning of a beautiful friendship. But the more I got to know Joe, the more that I realized how well he fit into our family and complimented Nikki. He can keep up with her, especially on vacation, which is no small feat. <laughs> Supports her no matter what. I love you, you know I love you. <laughs> She's busy. She has lots of energy, but we love it. Um, but no matter what, he loves her unconditionally. I am so excited to be standing up here today as my sister's right-hand woman, to be gaining an amazing new brother and celebrating their first day of forever starting now. So let's raise a glass again to the new Mr. and Mrs. Loria. I love you guys both. Cheers. Happy New Year. Mm -hmm. 